So, okay, guys, I will show you today the problem with these Oculus Rift glasses quest. I mean, black screen, uh, only flashing dots appearing and cannot connect, uh, whether you use USB cable or Wi-Fi, still the same problem goes on and on, just a black screen and nothing happens. Uh, I updated the drivers, nothing changed. I updated and reinstalled the factory, reset the software, I reinstalled uh, the game on PC, nothing happened. So, the thing which I did a couple of testings on my computer, I spent maybe several hours of. I find out this situation works for me and it solved my case. So, what the problem is, I think many of you which have the same problem is because you have a laptop gaming with an integrated video card and uh, some, uh, how do I call it, like an additional video card. So you basically have two video cards. So integrated is for power saving when you are on battery and the performance video card and with the entire cooling system goes for gaming. So what happens is it somehow gets glitched whether, because to connect a computer to that, you need to have um, a video card sending data to that screen. So what it means is one of these video cards has to be connected. Uh, I mean, a big integrated video card is a video card inside the chip itself, processor and uh, external uh, video card is uh, basically an additional GPU. So uh, there's some kind of issue which or what uh, drivers to use to send to that screen. So there's a, like a, a complicated situation I'm not sure uh, of what, but anyway, I'll show you how you can fix it. So all you need to do is you need to open uh, device manager. Uh, I don't, oh, no, sorry, maybe you can have a task manager. So um, uh, it, it wasn't here, sorry, uh, uh, um, device manager is here. So all you need to do is just write in the device, it should be on uh, selection. So, um, and you need to go to display adapters and here is the AMD Radeon graphics you just need to disable it are you sure blah 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 maybe a black screen and something and then it goes back on and the Radeon driver is disabled but the thing is there is a frame drop uh, using this as you can see right and there is some kind of well you can see uh, the screen itself has a lagging uh, tail and uh, maybe you don't see that much on, uh, on, on the video right now but the thing is, now you connect with your Oculus. Uh, I will not show you how you can how you can do it because I need to hold the phone. But maybe if you turn it on, maybe you'll see it. Because it also it turns on only when you are in a horizontal position. So, anyways, what happens is hello, are you on? Uh, it's a black screen there, but it's maybe because it's not turned on. Wait, I'll check. All right, it's on, but it's uh... okay. I mean, so um, I need to set it on. A stationary bound. You, you will not see anything right now because I'm in the quest. Anyway, you will not see anything because as soon as I take the goggles off, the screen turns black. But anyway, uh, I'll show you if I put on the glasses, I take the remote control. Oh, sorry. Roller coaster on. Uh, I'll go to. Uh, okay, battery pretty low. I'll go to Quest Link. Oh, sorry, I need to close the game. Uh, I can do it. Um, quit your current application quit okay uh, okay so now I'm in the main menu I, uh, I, 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 I uh, use quest link I use launch okay and uh, the menu turned on and what happened here is uh, it, it, it popped up uh, the the entire menu right here. So what happens if you by any chance uh, wanting to play a Steam VR? 
uh, you just open Steam, uh, you type in uh, Steam, uh, Steam VR, and you just launch it, and um, sorry, uh, yeah, Steam VR. And okay, so it's instantly connected also to Steam VR, and by any means, if you want to play the another game on the on the uh, pirates, let's say Space Pirate Trainer, uh, it's a game uh, I downloaded. It. So it opens up and it instantly uh, broadcasts. Uh, but uh, as you can see, uh, this screen is what you see from my goggles right here right now. But uh, you will see that it will be lagging. So all you need to do is just go back to the device manager, and uh, it, the screen is black because the goggles are uh, I've, I have it uh, in the air. Uh, or maybe the power just turned off because uh, I had only 5% of the goggles. So anyway, uh, it's no problem playing it any anyways, but, uh, or uh, I mean, and you need to just enable driver. I'm not sure if the game will not crash. That's a connection issue. Yeah, okay. So, uh, you need to do this, be or if it... Uh, you need to just uh, connect it back and it's no problem. I mean like uh, I, I shouldn't I, I didn't need to do I didn't need to Enable the driver while I was playing I need just to connect do nothing and then enable it But still uh, anyways, uh, the game is on right now working and I'm in the game already so uh, uh, So that's how you play this that's how you can connect it if you have issues Okay, heads are just full of the game noise. So anyways, uh, uh, so this is the easiest way, I think, and I had no issues. Uh, uh, sometimes it connects at the first time, somehow it's just black screen if you want to connect to the PC. So this is, this situation helps me, I find out, and it works for me always. So uh, if, you, if you have connection issues, you can just do it and it's all solved. Thank you for watching.